Hello and welcome everyone. So I have another person that has came forward and shared their results. This time it is not only the negative result, it's also the positive. And for all of you just to kind of show down here, it will show the numbers and will indicate if somebody had a previous infection when it is a negative result. Okay, so this is not rocket science. Uh, so as you can see that this one is a positive result, it's showing high, and the numbers are um, uh, basically showing that this person has this particular infection, which is HSV1. I just want to kind of shed some light on that. So with that said, I'm very proud and very excited to present this particular individual's information, which has given me permission to show these particular results and, as I said before, I've shown the positive and the negative for all of you to see. Now, I want everyone here to notice the date. This was back on January, end of January, let's say, um, where this particular test was done. And this was done at this particular place. And for those of you that know or don't know, this is the ordering physician. This is the person that is this person's uh, uh, care provider, and this is not the person that works f at this particular place. And if you call this place and ask if this person works there, you're a fool because they don't work there. <laughs> I, I, I'm just responding to one um, complete imbecile on the, the uh, uh, last uh, particular results I, I posted that um, basically stated that he contacted this particular um, facility and found out that this person doesn't work there. Well, common sense would tell you that the ordering physician doesn't work there. This is a testing site. The physicians are not on site. So, just for those of you that um, are unaware or just have this mental blockage because, you know, you're just um, completely told that you can't get rid of this, uh, just Follow the information shown in my videos. It's, it's really simple, and you'll get rid of this. Um, but if you have that mental blockage, and why I'm explaining this to everyone, then you won't get rid of it. You'll just be sitting on the sidelines complaining, just like some of the other people that are out there. And I really want to emphasize that this particular uh, test is very important because this particular person is showing... Um, not only their actual results for HSV1 for the positive, but they are also going to show the negative. And I just want everyone to see down here, before I get into this, the other verbiage that this particular test will uh, state so everyone can see that this is something that is very accurate when you do it at the same place. And... when you now have the particular test to the negative test to show your actual success. So this is amazing and I wanted to show the date one more time. This test was done on 4-5. Remember the other one was done into January. Uh, of course for privacy reasons I have to um, block out the specimen number on the requisition number and I am showing only the person's age, which is 25. I'm not really showing the name, and I'm just showing the uh, year of birth, okay? Um, I do like to protect people's privacy, and I do want people to see this information, as well as this particular individual that requested that um, this information uh, be shown, as well as the particular dates showing when these tests were taken to show how long it took this particular person. As you can see, this is the uh, I, IgG test, HSV1 again. The result is 0.91, which is negative. Now, you might think to yourself, well, James, what if you just showed this negative report as you did in the other particular case and 
the other uh, person that came forward? Well, it's going to say right here. And this is very key information. It may suggest early infection, which the other test already um, did show, which was the um, higher number, and it said high. And now this is negative because it's right at 0.91. So it's 0.91 or less. So this person's right within that range. So it's very, very easy to see that this works. And you can obviously see that this is the same person, person which is uh, uh, Demetrius. And I do want to uh, show you here um, the name. I'm going to actually block this, undo this so you can see on the other result. There you go. As you can see, this is the one on 128, and this is the same person. Okay? Everything is the same testing area. The only difference is the results have changed within the particular time frames shown here. Again, this is the high result that was showing at the end of January. And this is the negative result showing at the beginning of May. 0.91. So there you have it, folks. I don't know how much more proof I can give to people. There's always going to be negative people. This is why there are professional athletes that are really stars and shine and some that sit on the bench and aren't. It's the same thing when it comes to you taking control of your own body and making not only this particular uh, protocol and way to change your life work, but also having the mindset to continue following through with having a healthy lifestyle and healthy diet. Once you get used to this, it's really easy. I can't make everyone do this. I can't make everyone watch the videos and move forward. All I can do is post this information so you can see it, learn from it, and use it to your advantage. Any further questions, please feel free to send me a comment. Um, please realize that I um, rarely do respond to emails at this point um, due to the amount of emails that are coming in. And this is why I post videos for people to really um, want to move forward, take the initiative, and get it done. I just can't answer questions all day like I used to several years ago or even a year ago. Um, where I can just post videos and people can move forward from there. Once again, any questions, go ahead and let me know. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Look forward to seeing more of these and people moving forward with having the ultimate success of having their lives not only get back to normal, but having them regain their confidence and their well-being and just being happier overall in life. Thank you so much, everyone. Bye-bye.